Fruits were purchased for rupees 950. Nine boys ate three fifths of them in two hours. Nine boys ate three fifths of them in two hours. Six boys feel their stomach is too full, so do not eat any further. So nine boys ate three fifths of them in two hours. And but only three more boys are eating the rest. Six boys are keeping their dry fat. Let's assume all nine were eating. Then the remaining two fifth, how long would they have taken? They took two hours for three fifth. For two fifth, they'll take two into two by three. If nine boys had been there, in another two into two by three, four by three hours, they would have eaten everything. The remaining. But nine boys are not there. Only three boys are there. Only one third of our force is there. So how much time it will take? It will take three times as much time. Only three boys are eating. Six boys have said, okay, enough. Enough of bananas. Fine. So four by three, two into two by three is four by three. Four by three into three or four hours more. It'll take. Do this as simple ratios. Let's assume nine boys. We know that nine boys finished three fifth in two hours. Let's assume all nine boys are still there. To do the remaining two by five, they'll take two into two by three. Why two by three? Three fifth is done. Two fifth is remaining. This ratio is three is to two. Sixty percent they have finished. Forty percent is remaining. Two into forty by sixty or two by three. Two thirds of whatever they have eaten is remaining. Two into two by three, four by three. If all nine boys had been there, they can finish it off in four by three hours. But only three boys are there. They'll take thrice as much time. Four by three into three, four hours.